just throw it away. I need my stuff. Oh, yeah. But I know what we can do. We can sort it. Yes. Do you know what sorting is? No. Sorting is when you separate things based on size or shape or whatever. So they look really neat. Ready to sort? Sort of. <laughs> All right, Peg Plus Cat is a brand new show on PBS that's not only fun, it's teaching preschoolers a lesson in math. And what's really great is that there's a Connecticut connection. Here to fill us in is creator Jen Oxley and Haley Faith Nagrin, who is the voice of Peg. Nice to have you both here. Thanks for having us. Um, Jen, first give us kind of a synopsis of the show. Sure, it's a, a math show for little kids, and it features a little girl named Peg, voiced by Haley, <laughs> and her sidekick, Cat, always knocking stuff down full of life and energy. And in every episode, they're thrust in the middle of a math word problem that has to be solved right away. So, for example, they might be on the farm, and Cat accidentally lets out 100 chickens, and they have to <laughs> figure out how to get all these wild and crazy chickens back in the coop before the farmer sees. I see, it makes sense. And uh, now the show's being developed as a transmedia property. What does that mean? Uh, yeah, it's a big word, but um, basically what it means is that we're simultaneously uh, making the show, but we're also doing a website, we're doing games and apps and do-it-yourself projects. Um, so, for example, on the show, there's a segment where Kat makes a little flip book. Mm -hmm. You can actually go to the website and download that oh, flip book. It. And great. it's numbered, so it's got math lessons for kids. So there's a real connection between what we're doing on air and what we're doing on the website because we're all we're doing it all simultaneously. It makes sense. Now, yeah. Haley, you've been at a lot of other kids uh, to get this role. You're 10 years old. You're from Weston. We're happy to have you here. What's the experience? It's been like? Um, it's been really fun. I enjoyed a lot. You do? Now, do you change your voice at all? It sounds pretty similar. Um, well, I make it a little bit higher. Okay. Yeah. Got it. Um, and Jim, what was it about Haley's voice that, uh, said this was her. Well, we, we auditioned hundreds, hundreds of girls within the New York area, mm -hmm. and we were looking for a kid that had a real voice, you know, a real kid, not like a Broadway polished kid. Sure. Um, we wanted a real gritty sound because the character is really spunky and full of life, and Haley had that. Mm -hmm. She just had that spark that we were looking for, and we pretty much knew it instantly. Sounds great. And, and how does it work, Haley? Do you record first, or is there the cartoon first? Um, well, I record first. You do? Okay. And then the cartoon based off my voice. Got it. Now, uh, tell us all about Peg. Peg is a really energetic girl, and she has a best friend named Kat, and they go on all these adventures, and there's always a problem, mm -hmm. and they have to solve it involving math. Got it. So it teaches kids well. Um, now, fun. Jen, the cat in the story is kind of based on <laughs> one of your pets, correct? Yeah, my, my cat, Sydney, um, she, like Cat on the show, is always sort of knocking stuff down and, and, and getting in way, the way. She's really lovable and squishy. Um, <laughs> she also definitely inspired the look of the character. She's a black tuxedo cat, and Ooh. Cat on the show is this is purple. Have so. you met Sydney, the real cat yet? Not yet. You have to bring her in. Sydney, she's, she's great. <laughs> um, Jen, tell us about the book. Yeah, you know, the book's been out for a while. Um, we did the book with Random House, um, and it features uh, one of the stories um, on the show that I kind of talked about a little bit earlier. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, it, it, it's the chicken problem <laughs> where 100 chickens get out of the coop, and, and Peg has to figure out how to get them back Great. using math. Sounds good, and uh, it, it debuted earlier this week. How's it going so far? It's going great. Um, you know, we, we, we launched the show, but also simultaneously we launched, launched the website and mm -hmm. apps, so um, we're super excited about all that. Great, and now Haley, what's it like being a cartoon? It's really fun. Yeah? yeah. <laughs> that sounds great. What do your friends say about it? My friends are really supportive. They're always like, have a fun. Have a fun show, have a fun recording, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. That's great. Well, when, uh, when can we watch the show, Jen? Well, it's on um, every day at 9 o'clock on PBS. I believe it's also on at 3. Great. And I think we have it on our local station here weekdays at 9 and 3, right? And that's where we could find it. That's right. And the book is available just about anywhere? Yeah, you can buy it in bookstores. You can buy it on Amazon. Um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. Great. All right. Thanks so much for being here. Good luck with everything. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks for having us. All right. If you want more info on Peg Plus Cat, go to WTNH.com, click on Style. And coming up next, there's more Style, of course. But first, let's check in with Erica Walker. She's the host of Sports Edge on the scene. What's on?